Hey there, my name is Brandon Boyd, and you're watching Behind the Ink on pitcam.tv. So, uh, you're going to tell me a little bit about your tattoos today. Sure. Uh, where do you want to start? Why don't we start with my mom's name, Priscilla, uh -huh. and then my dad's name, Charles. And I got them on my body because they're my parents, and they're uh, the reason I'm here. Thank you, Mom and Dad. And I was really hoping that when they saw these tattoos, they were going to be like, oh, no, what have you done? They both were like, they both cried oh, of happiness. Really? You're so sweet. Like, uh, <laughs> How old were you? <clears throat> I, I was, uh, this is maybe 10 years ago, maybe more. Ten, 10 or so years ago. Okay. Yeah. Okay, and the rest? Oh, I, I mean, I don't even know where to start. This arm is sort of dedicated... Want? It's dedicated to Aubrey Beardsley, who's a uh, okay. favorite artist of mine. And so that's his portrait right there. Oh, that's nice. That's Aubrey Beardsley, and this is one of his favorite pieces. Um, it's from uh, uh, an illustrated version of Oscar Wilde's Salome. Oh. It's called the Peacock Skirt. I have a, I've been working on a tattoo on my back for a couple of years from a friend, um, an artist called Thomas Hooper. Mm -hmm. And um, it's not quite done yet. Okay. But... It's still my entire back, and mm -hmm. even though it's not finished. Um, Do you want to show it though? Nah. <laughs> <laughs> when it's finished, I'll show it to you. Oh, okay. How about that? Yeah. What about you? Let's talk about yours. No, no, no. You're up. You're up. <laughs> it's, it's you today. <laughs> okay. Um, this is one of the first tattoos I got. Mm -hmm. A friend named Vince uh, was wanting to try tattooing, oh, yeah? and so I said that he could practice on me. That's very nice. I thought he did a good job, right? Yeah. It was one of the first tattoos he ever did, and it was a good job. And then this red one, which used to be much more red, but now it's fading, uh, is the Tibetan Buddhist mantra, Om Mene Padme Hum. And um, I got it done in the kitchen of a friend's house. And we listened to Tibetan monks uh, throat singing <laughs> while, while we did it which is really interesting. They can create um, multiple tones in their throats. Have you heard of that before? Yeah, I've heard of that. Yeah. It was nice to get a Tibetan uh, mantra etched into my skin forever while listening to monks. Why did you decide to do a Tibetan tattoo? It's a, a mantra that always uh, resonated with me. I actually have it here as well. This has the same thing, but just okay. in uh, sort of the sort of mandala configuration. Um, it loosely, loosely translates to um, hail to the jewel in the lotus. Okay. Um, and so that's kind of the idea, isn't it? Is to, to, to bloom, to have our consciousness bloom. And the idea around the mantra is um, through repeating it, we are, uh, the intent is to generate uh, compassion for all sentient beings. Yeah. So it's about compassion. Cool. Yeah. Uh, are you very into Buddhism? Do you know a lot about it? I know a lot about it. Um, I, I wouldn't say that I uh, am Buddhist, no. Mm. Uh, I'm curious about Buddhism, but I'm also curious about lots of different things. Oh. Um, I am curious about spirituality, not about religion. Mm. Religion is sort of a, in my opinion, it's a kind of a politicizing of spirituality, yeah. and therefore it's dangerous. I agree. <laughs> All right. <laughs> any any other tattoos you want to show us? Um, ah, that's about it right now. Yeah. There's a fish that Jose from Incubus and I drew together. Uh -huh. It was also more red at one time. Okay, yeah. Um, but life happens, you know, sunshine and skateboard accidents, and it gets oh, yeah. more kind of skidded up. But he has the same tattoo, actually. It was sort of a friendship tattoo we did. Oh, okay. Hi, Jose. <laughs> Uh, so you need to get it freshed up? I've already done it a couple of times. Uh, <laughs> red is tough, as people yeah. who have gotten red ink will know. It's kind Does of it like itch on your skin? Because it itches like crazy on my really? skin. Really? Yeah. No. So no, it just gets dry. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> uh. Any any tattoos planned? The back? Getting that finished? Um, yeah, I'm going to get my back finished. Uh. Um, hopefully sometime in the next couple of years. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Thomas is a busy guy, and he should be because he's a very talented artist. Yeah. Okay, thank you so much. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> so, uh, so we did whatever it took to, for these songs, you know. Instead of making them Paramore songs, we really uh, did each song separately. Um, and any any experiments or anything that we wanted to try for each song, we, we just did it. Cause we